Oh, he's so cute. What's he doing? Do you like belly rubs? Do you want a bit? Yeah, he likes belly rubs. Yeah, good boy, good boy. What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Gaming Tag VR. My name's GT and today I thought I'd check out the lab. Test traveler, and welcome to the Aperture Science Subuniverse Exploration Center. <laughs> this is the Aperture Science Face Mounted Portal Sphere. It is your gateway to a vast continuum of undiscovered worlds. These undiscovered worlds may also contain undiscovered diseases, natural disasters, airborne toxins, and apex predators that hunt humans for sport. Put the portal sphere on your face now. You have not put the portal sphere on your face yet. Yeah, I know. I'm just... Do so now. Wow. <laughs> That's pretty amazing. Why is... What the? Oh, that's gorgeous. Hello. <laughs> Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Where, where am I going? Man, this is incredible. Oh, wow. That is awesome. Do you like belly rubs? Do you want a bit? Yeah, he likes belly rubs. Yeah, good boy, good boy. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Right, let's check out the lab. Test traveler of Pocket Universe Lab 8 has successfully survived. Oh, you here? <laughs> I can't get enough of that. Oh man, this is excellent. I've never blown up a blue. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. This is fantastic. This is making me smile. You want a ball? Go on in, good boy. <laughs> oh, good boy. Good boy. You should be a good boy. You should be a good boy. You should be a good boy. Good day. Congratulations, Pascal. Go on in, quick. Training. When you're ready, approach the calibration unit and begin calibrating cores. This switch operates the calibration unit height adjustment calibrator, which you can use to calibrate the calibration equipment to a comfortable operating height. Oh, hey, hey, so excited. Are you the uh, calibration guy? 
Great, great. It's my first time. Uh, pleased to meet you. What's your name? I'm Gil. Am I up for calibration? I can't see anything, but you know, it sounded like something was going on with that last calibration. What, uh, you know, what happened to the other guy? Is he, uh, is he okay? I, I thought, you know, <laughs> calibration would take a little longer than that. <laughs> <laughs> Trini, I got a deal for you. Up for bid. What a one of a kind museum. Oh! Rats and old garbage. You Sorry about the stuff. If you're planning to calibrate me, you know, I'll probably need about four or five rats. Or, you know, one medium sized. Oh, be around. Sending replacement core. I am the fruit punch core. Wow. Refreshing fruit punch. Please note, I will not dispense my radical flavor. I am the reverse psychology core, but don't worry, reverse psychology only works on stupid people. <laughs> I can tell you're far too smart to ever fall for it, so I won't eject me. Okay, Chief, we tried calibrating things your way and it didn't get a squat. If we're gonna do this, we're gonna do it my way, by the book. No more antics. This time is impersonal. My methods may be orthodox, but I get results. I'll see you in heaven! Calibrate me, and together we can tear this warehouse down. Yes, yes! <laughs> the name is Wilson on the boring hard boiled core. Button up a minute and I'll give you the lowdown on my latest caper. I'd been busy all morning straightening out a few affairs that had gotten gummed up. Now everything was finally on the up and up. What a racket. It was hot and sticky now in the afternoon. I worked the telephone, checking out leads. None panned out. After a while, the air began to cool off. I get a lot of leads. I write them all down. That way, I don't forget them. Now I was thinking about a dame. A hot number. I wanted to see more of her. I figured I might as well call her up. I had written her telephone number down, but it wasn't in my notebook. I would lost it. I fanned through my wallet. I couldn't find it. I let it ride, for now. I sat and racked my brains. Slowly the digits came to me. I dialed them. I let it ring a few times. No answer. I let it ring a little more. Still no soap. I hung up the blower. Time to get to work. I opened a drawer. There was my trusty snub nose th- <laughs> Sit down. I have troubling news. The investigation corps was killed in the performance of his duties earlier today. Well, right, let's check this out. Okay. Zortex. There is so much going on.
Successful completion of experiment in Pocket Universe Lab 8. Cool. Object retrieved. Oh, mate, that is hard work. It's strange how you play uh, like different bow games, how the arrows react. This one seems to be like the arrows are more heavier than what I'm used to, but more are coming. <laughs> I did not know that. Okay. What the hell? Wow. <gasps> what? Man, in virtuality, that is fantastic. There is so much detail. Test 
traveler of Pocket Universe Lab 8 has successfully survived an experiment. That's mental. It's like playing God. Oh! Oh, crap. Against all odds, Test Traveler of Pocket Universe Lab 8 has survived. Ah, there you are. <laughs> and look at you, standing alone in the dark. Uh, why? I, I am a terrible host. Here, take my life. I know my way around well enough without it. Don't be afraid. There is plenty to see. All you have to do is look. But don't be surprised if something looks back. Treasures may hide in even the darkest corners. I was just closing up, but don't let that concern you. <laughs> when it's time for lights out, well, you'll see. Well, I have a few deliveries to... Oh! There now, the good thing Roxbert is uh, out for the night. Maybe I do need a light in here. <laughs> Farewell, my friend. Bye bye. What the crap? Oh.
Congratulations, test traveler. Existential verification. Hello, repair associate, and welcome to the Robot Rehabilitation and Wellness Center. Our records indicate that you are the inaugural participant in our Human Diversity Outreach Program. You are holding dual aperture science prosthetic multi-tools. Please charge them in the multi-tool charging station. Charge your multi-tools at the charging station. Good. Now press the button on the multi-tool. Good. Your multi-tools have been fully irradiated. Please remove your radiation suit at this time. No suit detected. Good. There is a cabinet of drawers in your repair station. Please locate it and open a drawer. Good. Now close the drawer and open the correct drawer. Locate and open the correct drawer. Good. You have now practiced on two incorrect drawers. Please open the correct drawer. <laughs> Please keep holding the good. As explained in your orientation, you should, of course, never look directly into the drawer. Room sensors indicate you are currently looking directly into the drawer. You have just interfered with an Aperture Science Pocket Universe cap. You are now their god. Close the drawer to initiate Contaminated Pocket Universe Contingency Protocol. <laughs> good. Contaminated Pocket Universe Incinerate. Opening drawers has been removed from your list of responsibilities. Oh Please locate the service bay door lever and pull it. Now serving. Man, this is insane. from the schematic hologram, all Aperture brand robots can be repaired by anyone with even a rudimentary understanding of advanced electromechanical engineering. To begin repairing this unit, attach your multi-tool to its faceplate and pull as forcefully as you may hear what sounds to a human like mechanical screaming. But rest assured, while robots feel pain, they cannot express it. Good. Please locate and press the button marked Robot Repair. I can't believe the detail in this. Good. Step two. Locate half inch bore number 35 pitch bracket for amp flow motor D and disengage it from the appropriate linear actuator unless its electrostatic ion reactor is uncoupled from anodized multi axis servo bracket 733E and only if oxidization valves A, C, F, and H1 but not H3 are asymmetric to turbo pump exhaust manifold K is filled. Please take your time. Up to 30 seconds, at which point the thermal reactor currently uncoupled from its heat exchange unit will detonate. Alert flags and deploy. Uh, what? Again, take your time. 15 seconds. 15 second flax and deploy. Increase heart rate detected. Ocean sound station flax and deploy. It's not wrong. Do it. I don't believe it. What kind of robot can't handle the simplest? Oh, it's you. Congratulations on your quota filling promotion, by the way. You've opened all our eyes to what humans can achieve when you put your tiny little minds to it. Repair station recycling initiated. For your own safety, please vacate this station immediately. Don't listen to him, you'll be fine. Also, let's be honest. Your first day's been a bit of a disaster. It's probably not the worst thing if you die. <laughs> Repair station recycling in progress. I want you to know at first I was against this human diversity outreach program. But now, watching you flail around like a sweaty pile of ham, I see I was wrong. It's hilarious. Honestly, I think you're overqualified for robot repair. I've got a better assignment for you. Repair station recycling complete. Thank you for your participation. That's a recording. He has to say that. Goodbye.